Good morning and welcome to another edition of Your Property Matters with me, Mark Stern. I woke up this morning thinking to myself, I need to make another video, but I don't really know what I'm going to talk about. Um, I came back from my two week holiday a, a week or so ago, and I came back to seven people wanting me to take their property and put them on the market. So seven instructions. Um, speaking to colleagues and other estate agents out there, they're like, wow, how are you getting these instructions? What's going on? And I'm thinking I'm not really advertising. Um, they're all come through referrals. So most of them really are from satisfied customers who have referred me to their friends and relations and that's how I've got them on and that seems to be how I'm getting my properties on seems to be that way the last <clears throat> I suppose five to six months which is absolutely fantastic it means I'm not actually spending any money on marketing and it means I can actually literally create a, a great relationship to begin with because people are contacting me and they're already hearing good things and feeling that they can trust me. And that's making me think in, and, and delve even deeper into what is trust when it comes to business. Because we, on the other hand, hear so many stories of people that maybe have been friends with people for decades and decades. And then when it comes to business, it all falls apart and that's just not happening. And then you're meeting a total stranger who is trusting you to sell their property or anything to do with business over maybe established companies that have been in high streets or just large brand names. And what has occurred to me really post lockdown um, or during lockdown, and, and it's occurred to me, occurring to me right now, is the fact that what are we now judging people on when it comes to us committing to engage people to represent us or just to do business? It feels like with lots of the bigger name stores and companies that closed and went, um, well, just basically went to the wall during lockdown, that we no longer can really trust the name because the name may not be there for forever. But what will be there will be a person, um, you know, God forbid something happens to them, but that's the only thing, the person will be there. So what it seems to be now is that we are looking into relationships with people. And I find that me just sitting here talking um, to you and talking to this camera with nobody out there right now, but knowing that some of you will be listening to this is a way of me engaging and coming across and actually portraying myself as just Mark Stern and you know, when I first started up my business, I was always harboring on that I've got 42 years, well, at the time it was 40 odd years, 42 years experience as an estate agent. But that now is not really as important as people, it seems to like be people just getting to know me, Mark. So what I now talk about is that I'm Mark. I just happen to be an estate agent. You know, I'm Mark. I just happen to be a uh, a light bulb salesman or a mechanic. And funny enough, actually, my mechanic is somebody I totally trust as well. All these little industries where um, the reputations are, oh, you know, dodgy mechanic or don't trust the mechanic or don't trust the estate agent. Um, it seems to be that they're turning you around because what you're doing now is you're engaging with the person and you're trusting the person before their profession. So, that's just really what I wanted to just mention to you today is 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 the is is really thinking about the mindfulness, the way that we are, I suppose, evolving as people, as social creatures. We have evolved during this lockdown, and we are now looking at the person over the brand. Thank you very much. I'm Mark Stern, and have a great day.